A couple months back, I posted a successful 100 days run on YouTube where I played on the latest version. However, before that, I recorded another run on 1.8.9, which I'd say was a little less organised. For example, the way I counted my days was accurate. I, of course, died in this run, but I wanted to keep the footage and make a video on it. Also note that I didn't sleep in-game during this, but I did in my successful 100 days. So I guess to compare the progress, just double the day count. Anyway, enjoy the video. Day zero, I spawned in, watched my other 100 days video for my explanation why it's day zero and not day one, and got wood. Crafted a crafting table, made some wood tools, killed some cows for meat, got stone, and made a few stone pickaxes for mining. Collected some coal, put down some furnaces, and cooked the steak. I made a double chest and put all my stuff in it, and dug down to Y12 to make my mine. I wanted to get diamonds as early on as I could. I improved my mind by making some stairs and began my mining session where I listened to music and mined for two days. I got very close to dying here and I had to block myself in. I actually found loads of diamonds and made it into some armour and tools. Also, here I didn't keep track of my days, so I will just say day 2 to 12, as day 12 was the only recording where I actually showed my F3. Took some time to build an XP farm with ladders, presumably for a platform in the sky to improve my rates. This was last year, I, I don't really remember. And I built another portal so I could go and get blaze rods for the end. I lit it and I went in and this is what my spawn looked like. There were no bastions or different biomes in this version. I'd rooted out the fortress on a copy of the world, found out it was right behind where my portal was, so that was nice. I dug in and found the blaze spawner where I farmed blazers until I had 12 rods. I thought I would survive this fall and luckily I did, but I broke my legs in the process. And I decided to take a ton of damage here for some reason, and made my way out of the nether on day 12. On the night of day 12, I hunted endermen for pearls to go to the end. Day 13, I went exploring and found this village. Man, I miss the old villages. And grabbed some sugarcane for bookshelves for enchanting. There were some big ravines that I made sure to be careful of, and I got back and crafted some books. Day 13 to 21, yep, I lost track of the days again. I started the framework on my base, and when I was presumably getting ender pearls, I came across Reinhardt from Overwatch! No, but seriously, this skeleton was a, a full iron juggernaut, and I actually got his helmet as a nice trophy. I gathered some sand, made some smooth sandstone, and worked some more on the base. Can you tell what it is? Well, how about now? Well, if you couldn't tell already, it was a Five Nights at Freddy's inspired pizzeria, which I'm actually still pretty proud of. Mine some birch wood for bookshelves, and made an enchanting setup, which I used to enchant my sword with sharp three and unbreaking three, and my chest plate with fire protection three and unbreaking three. I continued with the pizzeria and added a roof, so the exterior was pretty much done. And now would be a good time to add that the texture packs I've used in the video have been in the top right the entire video, and I will likely put them in the description if you want them. Anyway, I changed my pack from uh, Azura 16x to Aether 16x. Day 21, finally we have a day counter. I switched packs again and built a staircase down into the actual pizzeria, which I was going to put underground. For the floor, I wanted to use quartz, so I headed to the nether to get some, which also got me some levels, so I enchanted my bow with power four. I started my enchanted floor pattern, and from day 22 to 23, I filled it in with some birch leaves, Though, looking back, it is quite ugly. And I chanted my sword with Smite 4, which, by the looks of things, I wasn't the most happy with. The zombie also wanted to remind me that I hadn't put enough torches down to stop mob spawning. Thanks, zombie. And I tested my bow on his friends. I also fully finished the floor of the first room, as well as added some things. Day 24, I wanted to set out to kill the Ender Dragon, so I said goodbye to the village 
and dug into the stronghold where on day 25 I found the end portal. I made a wall to stop silverfish from knocking me into the lava and crafted all the eyes. I put them all into the frame and took one deep breath, not really, and jumped in. Before the battle starts, I did want to mention that the Ender Dragon is so weird in 1.8.9. It is much harder than the current dragon fight in the latest version, and I really struggled to beat it. I was greeted by the dragon swooping down at me, which might have been able to send me flying and kill me, I'm not sure, but I pulled to the middle island as soon as I could and dug out to destroy the crystals. However, there were loads of towers scattered everywhere, so I started destroying the shorter ones, but started to struggle when I had a go at the taller ones. The Ender Dragon flung me up here, but luckily I survived the fall. I really should have brought a water bucket, you know? Anyway, my arrows were being drained faster and faster, and it was only a matter of time until I ran out. I started gathering blocks and used up my last arrows on this tower, so I got a few more pearls too. This was my last resort. I lied myself next to this tower and threw a pearl. It hit the pillar, and I panicked as I fell, but managed to save myself with a block. But as I was building up, this happened. And I probably haven't ever been as mad as I was in this moment, ever. I decided that if I tried in 100 days again, I wouldn't do it on this version. I mean, I didn't even think I would reattempt it at all, but I did, and you can see that run on my channel. I'll leave it in the description. So yeah, that was uh, my failed run. And I don't think you can use cheats to get Hardcore Worlds back after you die in this version. Because I did try to get it back, but after I died, but I couldn't. Thank you for watching until the end. I do appreciate it. And I do hope you enjoyed, even though this wasn't a full 100 days. Anyway, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.